Thank you so much and welcome back uh, to the program. And we begin straight away with our lifestyle item of the day. This morning it's all about the art of making mats. And it's actually a practical interview that we are going to be shown the basics of how to go about it in case you're interested in that new hobby that you, know, you could just start. This is actually one of those things that you can do during your free time. So with me in studio, I'm hosting Pauline Odiambo. She's the brain behind what you see, will be seeing on our set this morning and she's going to go you know much further to show us a bit about how it's done and also to tell us a bit about herself so thank you so much Pauline uh, for coming to the studios this morning probably you know just a word of hello to my viewer and tell us a bit about yourself as well okay good morning to our viewers my name is Pauline Odiambo as uh, you've been told so I'm an entrepreneur mm -hmm. Uh, upcoming one <laughs> okay <laughs> yeah still upcoming <laughs> okay yeah okay so basically what I do is uh, I make mats and pillows but uh, majorly on mats the pillows I do on orders okay yeah all right so today Pauline uh, you want you were going to show us how mats are made but then you know tell us a bit about the uptake of this particular you know the mats in in our country uh, you've been in that uh, business for quite a while uh, tell us a bit about how people are understanding it or appreciating it do do people really embrace you know the art of, of mat as as you would expect as somebody who makes them yeah i would say the art making uh, the mat making mm -hmm is actually like in Kenya people embraced it positively okay because you see anything which is handmade is normally perceived as good mm -hmm. which is true so when I started making it uh, it turned out to be something people really liked mm -hmm. like okay you are doing this for me the way I want it okay. it's different from when you go to the supermarket Environment. you get a ready-made okay. so this one is like you can tell me i want you to make it like this i want this color okay. i want this pattern okay. i want a name okay. yeah so oh, that's okay. why it's a bit different with the ready-made ones mm. so people embraced it like positively okay yeah. but it comes with a cost though but then yes. you know to understand the complexities of why it should be that costly and why people really appreciate it show us how it's done if in case today it's all about the art of making mats i just want to understand how they are made and you know what goes into design and all that so probably before you start what do you need like what are some of the tools that you need you have some in studio with us this morning you can yeah. just probably just take us through the process okay so for making the mats so what you first need is the tapestry this one mm -hmm. now this is the tapestry mm -hmm. so this is a, a piece but now you'll get according to the size you want to make okay so this is just for demo mm -hmm. but when you're making you get a bigger size depending on what you want to make mm -hmm. then oh, you for the floor for whatever for it is floor, that you want yeah, yeah okay for the door mm -hmm. depending on what you want to make mm -hmm. then we have a crochet mm -hmm. this one everything i get at biashara street yes yeah in nairobi <laughs> that is those were in nairobi uh -huh. other towns i'm not so sure okay. where you can get them mm -hmm. then you need a marker pen for the patterns mm -hmm. if you want to maybe make a specific pattern you have to draw it first okay so you'll need this one then uh, we have this one for measuring the thread because mm -hmm. it has to be a specific size mm -hmm. before you start doing it then we have the thread depending on the cam then uh, we have this one for measuring the thread because mm -hmm. it has to be a specific size mm -hmm. before you start doing it then we have the thread depending on the color mm -hmm. so it's the chunky one we have mm -hmm. two types actually okay. the thin we have one. the thin one yes. and this one the okay. chunky one okay. yes then we have the tape measure mm -hmm. you have to measure mm -hmm. it's mathematics also yeah, okay. yeah so you have to measure <laughs> then the scissor because you'll cutting. be cutting okay. yeah so uh, before you start like cutting mm -hmm. and all that mm -hmm. first you have to this one like the tapestry you have to thread all through mm -hmm. the edges mm -hmm. for it to, to be strong mm -hmm. yes so i can start by yes you can that sure. is what we want you know and you can also engage me if you want me to help you do something i'm good at <laughs> cutting that's the <laughs> one 
anything I know how to do. Yeah. So I'm first, not sure uh, I show you how to do this one. Yeah, okay. Then you'll do the cutting. Okay. okay. Yes. <laughs> then I'll do the first five holes. Okay. Then you can also do another five. I'm not sure I'll do five, but it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> so for threading all through yes. this one, the mm -hmm. edges, because uh -huh. you have to make it a bit strong mm -hmm. before you start uh, now the crochet. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, so tell me a bit about, uh, like, as you do that, okay. probably for this size, well, what is it? What can it be used for? Because it looks very small. Uh, this one. Yeah. This is for demo. Okay. Trust oh, okay. me, this one. There's nowhere in the house okay. you can put okay. this. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Okay. So you have to fix this one. Then mm -hmm. you tie. You tie it. Okay. Just normal tying. Okay. So when did you start doing this? Uh, it's been like a year. A year? Yeah. Uh -huh. And it's really good. Uh -huh. Plus, you keep yourself busy most of the times. Mm -hmm. Then you can only do it when you like it. Uh -huh. Yeah, you can It's like a hobby? Yeah, it's like a hobby. Okay. Yeah. So here we are. The normal... Way, the way our grandmothers yeah. used to do it. And the, You're taking even, us back. Yeah, when uh -huh. I was in like primary, uh -huh. I used to do the the sweaters uh -huh. just for fun okay yeah okay so this is just the normal way mm -hmm. you do like this i'm not sure i can quite do that but it's okay i hope our cameras are getting it just okay just lift it up for us mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. yes <laughs> so it's then let me start sorry because the thread is a bit fat uh -huh. so you have to be really farm with yeah, with you yeah first one uh-huh then you take this like this the then second it, one there yes. it goes okay then you bring this okay <laughs> it's easy it's not easy it is <laughs> then so where did you learn this from that's the first one okay that is just one. Yeah, that's Like all that one. you've done is just one. Yeah, but you see, I'm so used to it when I'm doing it, I'm so fast. Oh, okay. Going around. Okay. Yeah. So I can show you the second one. Okay. This is the second one. So how long did it take you to learn this? Uh, learning this? Yes. A day. Somebody taught you or? Yeah, someone showed me. Like I can know it today? Yeah, you can know it today. <laughs> I don't believe you. It's, but <laughs> it's so easy. Mm -hmm. Like doing this all around, mm -hmm. then now cutting, mm -hmm. then doing the crochet. It's just easy. Okay. I learned it in a day and it was not like a whole day thing. Mm -hmm. It was uh, like a 30 minutes thing, I mm -hmm. think. Okay. Yeah. All right. So as you stitch, mm -hmm. um, what are some of the things that one needs to consider for for it to be very firm and 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 you know long lasting? Do you see bomo like <laughs> you have you're to be out. very like firm when making it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You don't want it to be loose because mm -hmm. you know when you are done like doing the whole thing, it should form a like, uh, something which is a bit curvy mm -hmm. before you start crochet. Mm -hmm. Then now we are when you are done with the crochet, you'll feel the edges when they are very stiff mm -hmm. yeah so you have to be very firm okay. when doing it okay yeah okay so i don't know if you can I, i'm really really trying uh, <laughs> you want to, to see i don't know i don't know for linaki what see you it's not hard <laughs> show yeah. me the third one let the me see one. how you're doing it you see then Easy. You're going too fast, but it's okay. No, I'm not going too fast. Okay, it's because you're good at it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Like that. Uh -huh. Then. That has to be twice. Yeah. Let me try. But uh, this is just going to be so hard, yeah? So you told me you do this. Yes. <laughs> Uh -huh. It's just like any other. Uh, like I'll go art. as far as, as as far as I can. Okay. So you have like, no. you make it a bit tight. Yeah, a bit tight. Like that? Uh, no, the the other one. Yeah, that one. This one. Yeah, just like that. No, <laughs> this one. You make it a bit smaller. So oh, make okay. it tight. 
so yeah, I have to be yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, I hope I'm doing the right thing. So this goes in here. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're trying. Just tell me this goes in yeah. here. No, the second hole. The second hole? Yeah. There? No, the second hole going down. There? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. uh, first you have to like take the thread, go with it in the hole, then come out with it. Like that? Um, <laughs> no. Okay, okay. <laughs> Let me show you another one. <laughs> I tell you, this is so hard, like I told it's you. It's not hard. Yeah, but, but like I said, you know, so many people you take love this, to... mm -hmm. like this first, uh -huh. then you put it on the second hole, uh -huh. then you come again, and take, take another, another one. one, take it out, take it out, then take another one, uh -huh. remove it from the second, there's a second slot here, before you get to the last one, uh -huh. then you take another one, then you get it out. I, I can try as as far as the, the, the second slot. Yeah, <laughs> Let me see. Okay, so this is how it goes. The expert is here now. This is what you do. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually easy. <laughs> then you make uh, the loop very tight. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then um, you take, take the thread like that. From the other side. Yeah, like that. Then... Mm like that uh, then uh, you go like that <laughs> i give up <laughs> i give up and you tell us that you learned this in a day yeah i think maybe because when i was a kid mm -hmm. i used to thread a lot okay yeah okay so okay. what are some of the things that you know you consider before you decide on the design and uh, you know the pattern that that you want to come out with like uh, for example if you're my client mm -hmm, you mm -hmm. tell me what you want mm -hmm. I'll only do what you want okay okay yeah and I can also give suggestions on what will work on and what, what will, will work, work. Okay. yeah like for some colors you can't really mix them mm -hmm. but if the client insists the client is always right mm -hmm. you do what they want okay yeah but I'll only do what you want according to the color the pattern yeah Okay. So I don't dictate what you want, actually. Okay. Yeah. So uh, kindly tell me, um, like in case somebody is interested in learning, like I am really interested in knowing this, and I come to you and I tell you that, Pauline, I need to know how to make maths, probably for fun, for my own pastime, or for, you know, commercial purposes. Is this something you've interacted with before? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I can show you if okay. you want to. Mm -hmm. I normally show people. Uh, like if you're doing it for your own, maybe for your house, mm -hmm. I'll show you free. Mm -hmm. But if it's for business, I'll that charge you. That you have to part with something. Yes. Okay. But if just something for your house, that one is free. You just come with everything, actually. Okay. Because yeah. okay. you need it later. Okay. Yeah. All right. So t as, you, as, you, as you get the outline, <laughs> I'll, 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 you know, be interested in knowing what do you think, you know, maths add to, you know, the look of a room or, you know, the look of your house? What is it that, you know, when you're looking at interior design, so many aspects of it add something to, to yeah. whatever it is you're trying to decorate. So for maths, what do you think is the most fundamental thing that they add to the the look of a room or something uh, actually Matt for example now the carpet mm -hmm. I also do the carpet the mm -hmm. big ones mm -hmm. so it makes your house look more beautiful mm -hmm. more pretty mm -hmm. compared to an empty house mm -hmm. the doormat it can go with the color of the house mm -hmm. depending on your color okay the bathroom set mm -hmm. I don't know why people normally don't like decorating the bathroom the bathroom but it's part of your house okay. it has to look nice mm -hmm. so that one we also do according to now the color of your house okay like if your house is painted maybe blue you want to blend with a different color, mm -hmm. just tell me the color, then I'll do that for you. Okay. It will blend really so nice in your house and make the house look a bit more nice, pretty. Nice. Yeah. Plus you can use it to add color yeah, to, to add your color. house. If, if your furniture is dull or something yeah. like that, you can make a very bright mat and you know, throw it somewhere to add color. Exactly. There is just a, a request mm -hmm. from one of our viewers that I'm making this very hard for them. Like when I was doing it, I made it look so complex. There's a request if you can hold, you know, the, the, the hold it up and, and show our viewers, okay. like 
literally like just one one stitch for them to get it they're saying i'm making this very hard you can just explain it to that camera just step by step okay just one so <laughs> i don't know if they will get it we are going to make one hole mm -hmm. i'm going to do it very slow step by step yes so just, that everyone can yes. see it and ensure that your hands can allow space for for okay. them to see what you're maybe doing. Maybe I can do a loose one. Yes. A big one. Yes. Yes. For everyone to see. Mm -hmm. But now for when you're doing the mat, you it have has to, to be tight. tight. Okay. Yeah. So for the purposes of learning, mm -hmm. so I'm going to make a big one. You do like this. You mm -hmm. take the first one. Slowly. <laughs> okay. okay. <So laughs> I thought that was slow. For you, because okay. you, you know, the, we, we have amateurs who are just starting. No. Sorry, viewers. So... <laughs> I'm going to do one hole. Yes. Slowly. Yes. For everyone to see. So we are going to do this. Uh huh. You take the thread. The first one. Mm hmm Put it in the second hole. Uh huh. You take another one. Slowly. Let me make it a bit loose. Uh -huh. For learning purposes. Okay. Then you take another thread. You bring it out in the second hole. Uh-huh. Then another one. Then another one. Now the last one. And there you go. Uh-huh. I can do another one. Okay. Slowly okay. again. You take the first thread. Uh-huh. Put in the second hole. You grab another one. Okay. You bring it out. You grab another one. Bring it out from the second one. Okay. Then the last one. Okay. Was that uh, a bit? No, it wasn't. I hope. I hope that was <laughs> that was easy enough for. Okay. For but that one is so loose. Yeah. You can't do like that. Yeah. Like when you are now making the actual mat. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. This one is for demos. All right. Yes. So this week, I'm I'm thinking we may not be able to do like the, 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 entire, yeah, the entire. Yeah. We can't because of time. Mm -hmm. But then talk to us about some of the the the. the you had something that was halfway done. Yeah. Yes, you can just pull it up and show us so that you can we can get a picture of where we were going with this. Yeah, yes. like so I yes. have this one. Mm -hmm. This one is uh halfway. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so this is for a client. Mm -hmm. They wanted the mix of uh the, all these colors. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so for making the patterns I used a tin. Mm -hmm. You can use anything you anything. have in the house. <laughs> so I used the blue band tin, the five hundred grams one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to draw to the draw. circles. Uh -huh. Do you draw the circles on you draw it on the tapestry okay, before okay. doing anything. Anything on it, yeah. plus so the if, outline and all. Like yes. you draw everything that you yeah, want. If you are how, doing, okay. yeah. If you are doing like one with a pattern, first you draw the patterns before how you doing, want it to look like. Yes, okay. how you want it to look okay. like. So first I draw the surface. This is really nice. Yes. Yeah. Uh, you draw, then you first do these colors. Mm -hmm. So this one got finished along the way. Mm -hmm. That's why it's not. Oh, the, the yellow, the oh, yellow one. Okay. But at least I have the circles. Okay. Yes. Okay. So you first draw the circles. You fill in the circles. Then you now do the. Oh, you start with the the, the drawings first. Yeah. Normally then, you start with the drawing. Okay, that's yes. important. Um, one would think that because you were starting with the outline, somebody would think that that is where you start. Like you outline it first. No, after then. drawing the circles, you do now the edges, mm -hmm. the outline. Okay. Then you fill the patterns. Oh, okay. First. So what you were doing was just like it will be covered with the thread on top of it. Yes. Okay. Like Whatever this color one, you, you want. Can't, if you look at this other side. Oh, now the, I get it. Now why you have to do it tight mm -hmm. for it to bend? Okay. Yeah, because okay. it has to. So you can see this one. You can just lift it up for us. Yeah. See. Okay, so that is what you were trying to do on yeah, this Yeah, this other. is what I was trying to do here. Okay. This one. Mm -hmm. For it to bend. Okay. Yeah, because okay. it has to. So you can see this one. You can just lift it up for us. Yeah. See. Okay, so that is what you were trying to do on yeah, this Yeah, this other. is what I was trying to do here. Okay. This one. Okay. And if you can see, mm -hmm. it's very tight. Mm -hmm. Yes. So it will make the mat to nicely fold at the yes. edges. Wow, that's nice. That's yeah, awesome. When it's all done, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah. Then you do the patterns first mm -hmm, before mm -hmm. filling in now the remaining spaces. Mm -hmm. So the pattern will depend on what you want. Okay. Yes. Or it could be a name or whatever a you want. A name. Okay. Anything. So how do you cut, you know, the threads that you use to fill? If you can show us. Yes. Yes. How do you get to 
cut in case okay now it's different colors maybe you love purple maybe you love yeah. yellow maybe so how do you get to cut them and do you so consider something like I use this yeah length to yeah. measure the thread mm -hmm. so what I do let me use this one Okay, so. and Pauline on that, as you do that, mm -hmm. we're just taking a very short commercial break. We are coming back for this, just to show you uh, until the, the very final stages of how this is done. We're taking a short commercial break. We are coming right back. Thank you so much and welcome back to the program. We are almost coming to the end of our conversation very quickly. Pauline is just going to show us how the thread is cut and then probably on another day we will be able to continue from where we are going to stop but just that is the much we could do today. So very quickly Pauline, how do we cut the thread and then we can just you know carry this forward to another day. So you measure using this one. Mm -hmm. So you just take the thread all round this one like this to make it same size. Mm -hmm. So you just Then you tie it mm -hmm. so that uh, they don't fall when you're cutting. Just tie on this one. Then you cut on both ends. This is the easiest part. All right. Yeah. And there you have it. Unfortunately, we cannot complete this today. And uh, we will revisit this particular conversation. Thank you mo so much for watching the show. We take a very short break. Good morning. Kenya continues in a bit.